First impressions visiting Bucaramanga, Colombia. Now I first heard about this city from a taxi driver. I'm sure he was from there, so he was a little biased, but he told me Bucaramanga is the best city to live in Colombia. And he was showing me like pictures and magazines. I was like, all right, I'll check it out. So I finally had the opportunity to do so. It's a pretty cool place. Um, so in this video, I'm just gonna share with you guys my impressions and then just give you some, some things to keep in mind about the place. So let's start with the first aspect, which is the weather. And when I was in Bucaramanga, the weather was pretty much amazing. It didn't really get too hot, but it didn't really get too cold. And the weather in Bucaramanga is supposed to be the same as the weather in Medellin, which is a city known for um, its spring-like climates. And then I also did some more research, and they were saying that the three cities in Colombia with um, spring-like climates are Medellin, Bucaramanga, and Pereira. All right, so definitely as far as weather, Bucaramanga gets a point for that. Now let's get into the neighborhood I stayed at, which was recommended. It was called uh, Cabacera de Ollano, which is a very nice neighborhood, modern, nice restaurants, it's built up, um, you know, supermarkets, all that stuff. And it felt safe. So for anybody who's thinking about visiting Bucaramanga, I would definitely uh, recommend that area. And since we're on the topic of safety, before I came to the city, I heard, you know, it's a it's probably one of the safer cities in Colombia. And I, you know, I didn't go everywhere, but I remember I was at the airport and I caught a bus, uh, a random bus, man. It went the it started going up these hills and I was like, oh, man, we going in the hood. But even up there, like, I don't know, I don't think it was the hood, but even if it was, it looked OK. You know what I'm saying? So and then, you know, I walked around the city a little bit so I can I. For me, my short time there, I would say Bucaramanga is definitely probably one of the safer cities um, to, to go to in Colombia. All right, this next part is probably going to be the most like important part, and, that, and that's the feel of Bucaramanga. Bucaramanga, to me, feels like a big town. You know, and for anybody who's familiar with the Sabaneta area in Medellin, it feels exactly the same in a sense where it's kind of more like an like a old country town feel the, the the vibe feels like it's more laid back i i just think it's more for older like retirees maybe if you're like a couple you're not really trying to be in the countryside in the middle of nowhere but at the same time you're not trying to be in the hustle and bustle of a big city you're looking for that nice safe middle ground but on the other hand i would say if you're a, a younger person the city i don't know i think you would probably get bored quick the last thing i'm going to talk about is going to be something that's I would say keep in mind, um, like, so in Venezuela, they're going through an uh, economic situation right now, and Colombia's feeling that. And so if you're in cities like, you know, Medellin, Bogota, Cali, or, or just anywhere in Colombia, you see it when you walk around. But the thing with Bucaramanga is that it's like five hours away from the border. So when you're there, you really, like, it's really in your face. For example, there was a situation where I was walking down the street and up ahead there was a group of people with like backpacks and luggage and stuff and I thought it was like a, a backpacking group from like Europe or something but no it was a whole Venezuelan family and I, I was thinking to myself like dang I wonder where they're going like they got like shelter or they know somebody or something like that so you see it in other cities but because of the proximity of Bucaramanga to the Venezuelan border it's just a lot more in your face and it kind of like oh man it kind of sucks seeing that you know so um, that's just something to keep in mind but with that being said, that, those are my first impressions on Bucaramanga. I wasn't there long. I, it's a it's a it's a chill city, you know. Maybe in you know 35, 45 years, I'll I'll probably give it a give it a try. But with that being said, hope the video has helped you, and uh, I'll catch you guys at the next one. Deuces.